Hi, this is Tom with a quick tip for BricsCAD and today I'll show you how to attach raster image into your file and also how to properly adjust it. So I'm starting a new project and the only documentation that I got is the raster image of the site plan of the building that we will be working on and it looks like this. It's not much but it's better than nothing. It's the only thing that we have available. Okay, so how do we handle it? First, in BricsCAD, we have to go to the Insert tab and Attach Raster Image. Okay, we select our PNG file. And here you have got scale, but we don't know how to scale it. So this one is not important now. We just uh, attach the raster image into the file and place it somewhere in our drawing. Now that we have our raster image attached to the file, we have to properly adjust scale and the orientation of the image. Because you can see here I've got some di dimensions and I see that this dimension, this size should be 11,205 millimeters, but when I measure or when I create a dimension from here to here it's only 178 so we have to adjust the scale of the raster image to our drawing first I'll delete this dimension and how do we do it? I select the raster image and type in the command scale Okay, first it's asking me for the base point. It doesn't matter where I select the base point, I can select this one. Now it's asking me for the scale, a numerical value, which I don't know. So I want to select the base scale. Okay, I select base. Now it's asking me for a base scale. Now I have to find somewhere in my raster image a distance that I know the dimension of. So I will choose this dimension. So I will zoom in and I click somewhere here. It will not be precise, but it will be precise enough. So somewhere here. Now I zoom out from this point and I click here to this point. And this distance between those two points I selected is my base scale. And now it's asking me for a new scale, which is what should be the distance between the two points that I selected. And I know this distance, it's 11,205 millimeters. So I type in 11,205 and I press enter. So the, diamond, the raster image has been scaled. Now I can choose zoom extends to zoom to the image. And now when I draw a line dimension from somewhere from here to here, it's 11,219. It's not precise. Raster image will never be precise but it's good enough uh, as an underlay and as a base to start working with. I will delete this dimension. The last thing that remains for us to do is to align the raster image properly so that the walls of the building are properly aligned with our coordinate system. We could mm, work on a non-aligned uh, non -aligned parts of the drawing you can check out my tutorial about that, but here it would be much easier to just rotate the raster image properly. So we'll do that. We will select the raster image, start rotate command. Now it's asking us for rotation point. I will select, for instance, the corner of this building. And now it's asking me for the rotation angle. I don't know it numerically, so again I have to select the base angle 
and now it's asking me for the base angle. I'm selecting the base angle. And the base angle I will select from this point to this point. That's my base angle. And now BricksCAD is asking me for the new angle uh, for this angle from here to here. And I know that I want to have it directing to the right. So I can select the new angle to be zero. Okay. And now the walls are aligned to my coordinate system. So now that I have my raster image properly scaled and aligned, I can start drafting the usual stuff, my walls, and I can use the raster image as a reference. Be careful, it will never be it will never be uh, perfectly aligned, but it should be good enough to see major mistakes. Okay, hope this helps and take care.